I am going to beat League of Legends. This episode, Azir, the Emperor of the Sands. I might eat these words, to be honest. But when I was in the practice too earlier, I'm just kind of messing around with him, reading his abilities and stuff. He doesn't look that bad, to be honest. He doesn't like, like he doesn't look that hard, I should say, is what I'm trying to say. Like I'm not saying I'm gonna be amazing at him, but like I'm not. It's, it's not like I'm trying to, you know, master this champion and you know do all the fancy stuff. I'm just trying to win seven games. I think for those purposes, he's not gonna be as as difficult as. I initially thought. I think this will be nice and simple, nice and easy. She okay. She picked Riven into Garen. There's no way. The only way this Garen loses. I know this from experience. The only way this Garen loses is if he's actually lobotomized, and even then, he might still win. That really? Oh my god, I can't believe that. I was so tempted to go after the fucking... The, the Riven? I should've. I really should've gone after the Riven. I am out of mana! Okay, whatever. I, w I wanted to try and save the Garen. In case you're wondering why I didn't just go after the... Dead... Dead as hell Riven. <laughs> I thought I might be able to save the Garen. Oh, that's how you do- Wow, that's a lot of mana. <laughs> no, press all after it and you're faker. Damn it, was that easy? That's crazy. Oh my god. I got stun locked on like trying to- On considering all of my options there. Because I was trying to think of if, if there was an opportunity there for me to like do the Shurima shuffle. And then I just kind of let Cat ult <laughs> for free and I did nothing. How is Riven beating Garen? How? That comes out so slow, dude. Holy sh- I guess what I should do is like... Try and ult it in a direction that the back is closer to her and it comes that way rather than aiming it at her. Cause that that took that took like seven to ten business days to reach her. Why am I big of the All plan. All plan. 100 percent plan. Successful Shurima shuffle. <laughs> it almost worked. If I had health, that would have been a kill. If I had, if my team was actually f***ing conscious. Bro. Hey yo. Hey yo. Oh sh <laughs> At least I didn't do too bad. <laughs> what? What? I was not even looking at the map. I didn't even know what was happening. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell happened? That's a nice surprise. Oh my god, dude. One of the worst parts of this series is having to relearn how to CS with every single different character that has different damage values on everything. Oh no! <laughs> no! Why would you come back in, Yasuo? Oh, unfortunately, there wasn't really anything for me to, like, shuffle them into. I did the motions, but, like, once I do it, it's like, all right, uh, now they just jump on me and I die. Let me see if I can get this real quick. I know. Alright, yo, 
yeah, I mean, that works. <laughs> Good job, Seth. It's just that easy, chat. Difficult champion? I don't know. You just you just put the you put you put the minions down and then you you do the stuff. It's that it's that easy, bro. Also, have a twelve and five set on your team. That's that's crucial. That's critical. See how Seth got first blood? I mean, I assume he just punched him. I don't really think there's anything to watch here. Wait, I think this is already. Oh wait, no. Okay, he he literally just walked in and then punched. He actually just. He's literally just punching him. He's- He literally just punched him. <laughs> he literally just punched him! Oh my god, did she survive from a fucking level up, bro? Unbelievable. I think she actually survived from a level up. Boom, boom, boom. This character is really good at just smacking towers, ain't he? See, here would have been a great place for it. I. <laughs> so close, dude. I had Zanya's. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Oh. Okay. That was really dumb. You saw nothing, chat. You saw nothing. You saw absolutely nothing. Surrendered. Easy content, baby. This is nowhere near as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Picked him up pretty fast. I mean, again, I still stand by my opening statement of he doesn't actually seem that difficult. Like, to master him? Yes. Sure, I'll yield to that. But like, to just pick him up and be decent? He's not that bad. Cause like, he's, he's range, he can harass anybody that's melee. Um, and he has some some escape tools, so he's not that bad. <clears throat> he's just weird. Yeah, and he takes towers fast, so like, even if I'm not getting fed, I can still contribute uh, a pretty good amount. Now, all of this, like, I, I've only played against, uh, I think, melee mid lanes so far, right? So, I don't know how he does against a ranged mid lane. Like, how does he do against a Lux or a, a, a Zareth or something? Would I consider him for the fun wheel? Um, I don't know. I'm not hating him. I, I, I am enjoying him a little bit. But Fun Wheel is like, do I want to play this character again? Right now, I'm not sure I care enough about Azir to want to play him after these seven, the seven wins. That might change, but I don't know. Surely we... Oh god. That was so close. Surely we get him, right? Okay. Cool. Excellent. Why did I do it that way? Why did I do it that way, chat? Why did I do it that way? That's the kind of shit I mean by when I say he's weird. I have to, like, ult in the opposite direction to actually get what I want. Damn, this is kind of nonsense. I'm not gonna lie. The fact that I can contribute to Dragon on the other side of the wall. I'm gonna do this again, actually. And there's nothing you can do to stop me, actually. <laughs> now imagine if I wasn't by myself in these in these situations where I'm pulling this shit off. Imagine if my team wasn't just scattered to the winds, doing who knows what. I should just get out of there, to be honest. I should get out of there or get the top inhibitor. Just leave, dude! Two of us are not in there! Just leave! 
Why are you still there? You already got the inhibitor. How in the hell? All right, I guess they've managed to 3v5 that somehow. They did it. All right. Yeah. All right, you're right. Damn. <laughs> I mean, Pantheon ulted over uh, at the end, but like, they fought the majority of that 3v5. Uh-oh, Brand. Okay, this one might be cooked. This one, and on the Faker skin too? Looks like fried chicken is on the menu, boys. Easy Hoon skin? Bro, I, look, I see SKTT1. Faker's literally the only pro I can name, all right? <laughs> I mean, Faker plays this champion, right? I mean, he plays like everybody, but like he's, he has played this champion to like, ex, you know, extra exceptional levels. Even for him, right? Mordecai's a jungle. Ooh, and a Garen. Oh, this just... Their entire team, minus Nami, is miserable. That's crazy. You hate Nami too? I don't think I've ever heard anybody say they hate Nami. You might be the first. Nami, as far as champions are concerned, Nami seems like one of the most inoffensive vanilla champions they've ever, like, made. Such a... Cool champion. Incredibly interactive. Very fun to play against. Such high skill expression. Just gonna make sure he is well aware uh, that Brand has no flash. The perma pushing Brand has no flash. There we go. There we go. Thank you. Bastard. <laughs> How are you gonna die to the exact same thing two times in a row, bro? Ain't no way, chat. Ain't no way they fall for the same thing three times in a row, chat. I, okay, I actually could have killed him. I did not expect myself to be able to do that much damage. I'm gonna be honest. I kind of threw that. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm, oh sh I have fed. <laughs> when did this happen? <laughs> All right, Caitlyn. <laughs> right, Caitlyn. I I remember now. Oh! <laughs> Meanwhile, in their base, my team does something. <laughs> I think we both Zonya. <laughs> we both did Zonya <laughs> at the same time. Hey, whatever. That's fine. You wanna? You sure you want to split bot, bro? I mean, <laughs> I don't care. Now you deal with this guy. Have fun. <laughs> oh, it's an open and hit. Okay, well, while they do that, I'm just going to end everybody's fun and win the game. Okay? <laughs> I'm just going to win the game while you guys do that. Chat, how many of you had this on your bingo card? How many of you had me mastering this champion in literally two games and just popping off on your bingo card. <laughs> More guys are left. Oh, <laughs> uh, I just, oh, you love, I, I absolutely just love when a Mordekaiser gets a penalty. I, I, oh, it just warms my heart when the champions that I hate more than anything else get punished. <laughs> we, you said f you to everyone who voted us here. We demand an apology. That remains to be seen. We still, we still got three skins left. This dream might turn into a nightmare.
Uh oh. You you got all right. Okay, guys. Don't you love how I never get uh, jungle help when I uh, when I'm facing against a ranged top laner? But if I'm a ranged top laner, the one in time in recorded history where I am forced to play a ranged top laner, I get camped to shit like that? Isn't that amazing? Cool. What? Why didn't my flash not go off at all? You can't flash in her ult? What? I wasn't trying to flash into it. I was or out of it. I was trying to flash to the other side of the of my wall. Are you telling me I can't reposition flash inside of her ult? What the hell are you doing, bro? You we are not winning that. You do you not see how fed she is? Like we actually went in one at a time. We actually went in one at a time. We actually went in one at a time. For some reason. I actually do not know why. I don't know why they went in like that. I guess I could have, yeah, I could have used my passive on the tower, but still, I don't think we should have fought that. I didn't think that through. The duality of my Azir. The most surprisingly good plays followed by the most predictably terrible plays. Camilla's splitting bot. We're actually just wasting time, I think. Camille is the opposite. We just threw! That's crazy. By being indecisive, we just threw. <sighs> I should have just listened to my gut and just recalled earlier rather than cancel my recall like three times. Instead of trying to do a fun push, we just lost the game off of that. Today, you will see the power of ascension. Nobody will see the power of ascension. They removed that game mode. It's gone. Oh, I guess. Oh my god, man! Oh god, okay, right. I jump scared myself! I'm just gonna take this tower. Dude, this champion is really good, what the hell? No wonder they had to nerf this champion into, into oblivion. Dude, if we just, like, actually went all at the same time rather than split up like this, we'd just easily win the game. Okay, whatever. Enough of the carries are there. Alright! <laughs> well... <laughs> that's one way to do it as well, okay. I mean, it was kind of inevitable. We were just gonna get Dragon Soul and then maybe Baron and then win. So, yeah. She is so f***ing tanky. Like, even when I can harass her back, she takes, like, no damage. Oh my god. Oh, get out of here. I could probably get that. Oh, wait, there's no plate. Oh, God! Oh, Jesus Christ! Get in hell! Where did you even come from? <laughs> run! Run, baby boy, run! 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 No, you fool! It's not worth it! Oh, they are pinging the shit out of Baron. Okay, I'm gonna go and... Yeah, try and deal with this, I guess. They surrendered! Damn, it's just that easy, chat. <laughs> it's just that easy. Ace Attorney Azir. Crazy to think that if I had drawn Azir just a couple of weeks ago, we would already be done. <laughs> but then you couldn't put Phoenix right clips in the video? 
I mean, I still probably won't because I've never played the games. It's not like I have any idea. The Literally, the only Phoenix Wright reference I am aware of is objection. objection. That's it. <laughs> he, he had no way to go. My god, dude. This fucking Ivern is, is just living here. He's a tree, he can't live anywhere. He can live in the jungle where he fucking belongs! Oops, he left in Azir alone with a tower for 20 seconds. Damn, that's crazy. Oh, bad. <laughs> I'll still take that. I think that still worked out as well as it could for a misplay. Tower did do a lot of work. That's why I put it there. <laughs> Oh my god, dude. I've missed two of my ults. Ooh, is that a surrender? Is that a surrender? That's a surrender, baby! Azir Prodigy! Under 10 games, chat! Under 10 games! I lost two games total, chat! How many of you... How many of you thought... That this would be a single digit champion, chat? Yeah, forget those last two opens. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. How many of you thought that I'm actually a hidden... A hidden talent when it comes to this champion? This is not what I expected. <laughs> it's just karma paying me back for ribbon. You know what? I'll take it. This champion, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, this champion surprised me. He is actually pretty fun. I think that means that uh, we have another champion added to the fun wheel. Who would have thought? <laughs> Who would have thought? Definitely not me. He's actually surprisingly fun. And he's not as hard as I thought he would be. So I think I actually am down to, to play him again at some point in the future. He's really not that bad. I think, honestly, he's like over... I don't know if overhyped is the right word, but I feel like the aura around him is like the 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 high skill, like high intensity aura around him, it's a bit overblown. He's not that difficult to just pick up and do okay with. Like obviously I'm not a master at him, you know, I can't pull off all the really crazy shit consistently. Uh but just getting just being decent with him? really not that bad yeah he's got a i feel like he has a really high ceiling but the floor is not really the floor doesn't feel like it's unobtainable i can't believe it. i actually can't believe it <laughs> this this dude took actually nine nine games to beat that's it this was a nice champion to do after um after the the frustration of riven even though riven was also fun but the games were terrible so just having relatively decent games on a champion that was actually surprisingly fun, we take those. But chat, here we are once again. All right, champion number one. Let's see what we got, chat. Oh, bro, my heart was about to stop. I saw it slowing down, approaching Anivia, and I was about to fucking, oh God. <laughs> Hecarim. That's fine. Whatever. Not really that exciting, but I'll I'll take it over Anivia. I almost pooped my pants a little bit. Alright. Champion number two. Oh. Okay, I guess. <laughs> I, I don't think I've ever played this champion. <laughs> It's not as bad as I think. He does not seem very interesting. I mean, he doesn't seem like I would hate him, but like, I don't know. Whatever. Uh, okay, so Hecarim, Ivern, and... 
Come on, give me some hype. Give me some hype. Give me some hype. Well, <laughs> I was hoping for Nico, to be honest. I, I was seeing it start to slow down. And I was hoping maybe it'll get all the way to Nico, but no. Okay. I'm not gonna lie. None of these really seem that interesting to me, but... Thankfully, it's not up to me, so I don't have to have an opinion. Let's see what... Let's see what it's gonna be. Wow. Ain't no way. <laughs> Why is it so close between these two? <laughs> okay, some of you... Some of you lurkers are actually gonna have to vote in this poll, it seems. Because this is actually close. <laughs> Wow, it's down to the wire! <laughs> That's actually the closest it's ever been. <laughs> Holy sh- Okay. Alright, it's Hecarim. Alright, cool. Well, I guess, uh, I guess Hecarim is the next champion. 10, 11, 12. That's not too bad, I guess. And, I mean, I played him before. He's not terrible. Alright, cool. Well, um, let me see. Do I want to start- I mean, I guess I can technically start Hecarim today. I just don't know if I want to. Or... I can play Yasuo. I can actually play some some games for funsies. Chad, have I ever mentioned how much I fucking love this champion? Have I have I ever mentioned just how this is the absolute pinnacle of uh champion design they've ever had in this game, and that no other champion will ever compare to this champion. Hmm, let me not, let me not. He's so tanky! God, I love Yasuo. This is, just the, this is just the best champion they ever created, chat. Alright, I got to play Yasuo. Let's see if we can get a Samira game. Oh my god, dude. It hit me, unbelievable. keep getting bounties because they keep split pushing and my team is just kind of chasing kills and not really doing anything when we uh kill people should i do a chat should i make the baron call should i just ping the baron am i going to become what i hate i'm gonna do it i'm gonna ping the baron <laughs> it's just that easy. Man, the difference it makes when I'm playing a champion that I actually know. Oh my god. Who do I want to play? Who haven't I played in a while that I really want to play? <laughs> Why Riven in my top 10, chat? Why Riven in my top 10? Later. So, yeah, I think that'll, uh... 
That'll be it for me, lads. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, comment, all that stuff. We'll start hacking them up on Friday. All right? So, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching the video. And I'll see you motherfuckers next time. All right? Peace.